Hey, sweet friends, I wanted to take a second just to kind of explain some of the business changes that we have made lately. Really, thanks to you guys, our business is growing, which is exciting, but also there's just a lot going on. And so I thought I would make a real quick little video just to kind of explain to you what Rock City Cookies looks like now. So let's talk about it. Welcome to Rock City Cookies, where we talk about all things cookies. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon to be notified when we upload a new video. Thanks for watching. First off, I want to follow up with my corrupted hard drive and all of the videos and pictures and everything in my cookie career that I lost, I still do not have that fixed. So it's been an interesting transition because since I no longer have all of that old content to kind of lean on, it has caused us to sort of pivot and rotate our business in a new way that I think is really exciting. And I actually feel like it has caused us to grow even more. So even though I'm still so heartbroken about that hard drive and I'm still praying for the day that we can find someone who can maybe fix it, I do have to say that if that wouldn't have happened, we probably wouldn't be in this place with the business today. That being said, I am excited that we are starting to really kind of expand our business. Now we're still, what is that called? Like grassroots company. Like it's still just me and my husband, but we are really starting to expand what what we're able to provide. And that is exciting and a little scary and a little trial and error. So here's what's going on. And I'm going to start with Etsy. Now Etsy has provided income for us for the last couple of years. Really, actually, I, I started on Etsy in 2020. So it's actually been three years since we have had a shop on Etsy. And in doing so, even that has pivoted and changed throughout the years. So we originally started by selling our decorated sugar cookies on Etsy. And that was done as a way for me to be able to make more income on my cookies and not be so boxed in by our local customer base who may not be so willing to pay those higher prices for the cookies. And again, I have like a whole series on Etsy, so you can go check that out. Eventually that got to be a little overwhelming for me and our life and um, as a mother and a homeschool mom and a wife. And so we decided to pivot again, and then we switched to selling cookie cutters, which has been the slow growth. We don't have a lot of cookie cutters out there because I actually really like to only sell the cookie cutters that I have made personally personally cookies of. And I know that that's kind of a weird business model. And I do see that probably changing as we continue to grow. But for me, it's like we wanted it to kind of be a slow growth. Etsy, we kind of felt like we didn't ever want it to be too much too soon. So for us, we always wanted quality over quantity. And so we took our time developing our cookie cutters and we're still doing so because it's a lot. My I have to design the cookie cutters. My husband then has to actually go into the computer and design them in the 3D software software to and then he has to print them and he has to kind of tweak them and even designing that takes him a little while and then he has to design multiple sizes. So Etsy itself is kind of just been this like slow growth. However, this year we have really taken off in our Etsy cookie cutter business. So I say that to kind of encourage you if you're on Etsy, just keep sticking with it. You never know when it's going to take off. But 2023 has brought us like we have, I think like 600 times grown <laughs> I don't know how to say that. Like our growth is at like 600% this year on Etsy so far. And we're only in April, which is really exciting. But it also is kind of putting a fire in us to really kind of feed into Etsy and just keep that momentum going. So what that looks like now is yes, we are going to continue to add cookie cutters. And pretty soon we'll probably add cookie cutters of cookies that I haven't made sets of yet. But it also means that we're looking into how can we sell other things on there to other cookiers that we have not yet like tapped into. That means that we have started to put our cookie classes on there. We've now I've created started to create these guidebooks that go along with the cookie classes, the tutorials. And so those are going on Etsy. And as of like the last couple of weeks, I have started putting digital downloads on there as well. So it's like every single thing that we do, it just kind of leads to another thing and another thing and another thing. And it's just kind of all an experiment and some of it works and some of it may not. But 
it's all pretty exciting. So now our Etsy is not just cookie cutters. Now our Etsy is cookie cutters. It is cookie classes. It is step-by-step -step guidebooks and rural icing transfers. And in the future, I'm hoping I can, I can branch out and do some cookie cards that go with like gifts, cookie gifts. I'm hoping that we can start putting our digital like STLs, the files for other people who have their own 3D printers to just be able to purchase our files and print their cookie cutters at home. Because honestly, if I didn't have a husband who knew how to do all of that, there's no way that I would be able to create my own cookie cutters, I would definitely be buying them from other people and just printing them on my 3D printer. So there is a whole industry for that as well. So we will continue to expand our business there, which is exciting. However, we also have grown on YouTube and YouTube is like my passion project. I would say more than anything else, YouTube is what brings me joy and satisfaction and it makes me happy out of everything that we do. It's the part of the business that I really genuinely love. And so that being said, we have been, I have been on YouTube since 2021. My first video was April 1st, 2021. And since then it has taken us two years, but right before my second anniversary of YouTube in March last month, I finally reached monetization, which if you know anything about YouTube or YouTubers, like that's like the pinnacle. Like once you reach monetization, it's like so exciting. It's like the first really big goal that you reach on YouTube. And to do that, you have to have at least a thousand subscribers and 4,000 hours of watch time. Well, I have had the thousand subscribers for a really long time, but those 4,000 hours of watch time take a really long time to get, but I finally got it. And so I'm so excited that now I actually get paid from YouTube for those little pesky little ads that you see on the video. So even if you don't see ads, you pay not to see ads, which is us. We have the YouTube thing where you don't have to watch ads. You just pay every month. So I still get paid from those subscribers as well. You just can kind of get a flat fee. So if you're paying, to not watch ads, the people, the creators still get paid for your view, which is pretty cool. But with that unlocking of me now being a YouTube partner, that also means that now I get access to a few fun things like I can do a YouTube membership. So YouTube membership is very similar to like a Patreon experience but it's directly on YouTube, which is really exciting. It just makes it easier for YouTube creators because we're already uploading our videos into YouTube anyway. And so that way we just have an option to only show certain videos to our members, which is pretty fun and cool. And it definitely makes it easy for us for those people who just want to just be on YouTube as a platform instead of going to Patreon or any other platform, they're already on YouTube, they can just sign up there and they can get access to exclusive videos that way. And a lot of creators have jumped on board with this as well. I have already had Patreon, I've had Patreon for over a year. And so I have Patreon members on that platform, which is fantastic. But this just gave me a secondary option. But it doesn't matter if you are a YouTube member or a Patreon member, you're getting the exact same benefit this on YouTube, if a creator has a membership option on their page underneath their videos, you'll have your normal like like, dislike, subscribe buttons. But then right next to the subscribe button, you'll have or you'll see a join button. If you click on that, then you can see the different tiers or different options that every creator has and they get to choose and customize that. But you can pick one of those options to become a member of their channel. And so for me on YouTube, I have three different tiers. I a 99 cent tier, which just is like, it gives you emojis and it gives you badges. If you've been a member for so long, it's really just kind of the 99 cent tier is just really kind of a way to show support to me as a creator or other creators that have that option as well. The second tier is the 299 tier and it's called frosting friends. I think the first one's called sprinkle squad. And then you have frosting friends at 299. Now on that tier, you just get all of the videos. So all of the exclusive member only videos you will have access to with that tier. You just don't get any of the extra stuff. So you don't get the guidebooks or the digital downloads or graphics, things like that. You just don't get those extras when you're on that tier. It's strictly just you get the video and you get a 20% off coupon to our Etsy shop for any of the products 
every single time you shop, you just use the special code that I have provided for members. And when you check out at our Etsy shop and you get that discount, that 20% off for all products every single time you shop with us. So that is what the Frosting Friends is. And I actually added that tier to Patreon as well. So if you wanna sign up just to get videos only, nothing extra, then you can be a Frosting Friends member on either YouTube or Patreon. But the $4.99 slash $5 tier is called Royal Icing Royalty. And with that tier, you get all of the member exclusive videos plus the digital downloads on our Etsy shop. So that includes all of the step-by-step -step guidebooks that go along with the tutorial videos. And it includes all of the Royal Icing transfer sheets. As I make them and sell them on Etsy, I will also post them for free in that Royal Icing Royalty groups. With the $5 membership, you also get access to the private Facebook group, which is basically just a way if you aren't a Patreon fan, if you aren't like a YouTube membership, like where you don't want to have to go look up all the stuff that just gives you a chance to be able to access it on Facebook, which is sometimes just easier to navigate. Really, that's the difference between the tiers. Um, basically, Frosting Friends, videos only, Royal Icing Royalty, you get the videos plus all of the digital extras that come along with all of the different videos. I hope that clears up any questions you may have had with which option and what's the difference. But I wanted to kind of share that because it's all new. This whole process is new as far as the YouTube membership being even available to me. But since I'm now a YouTube partner, I get to have that. So I just wanted to take a second to explain what that meant and what all of the different tiers are. Okay, so that is really kind of the big changes in our business. I also took a year off of social media with Rock City Cookies. I just needed that mental break. I was just kind of overwhelmed with life last year. And so I wanted to be able to put all of my focus on YouTube and not really focus on all of the other social media platforms. And I just, I gave myself a year and I said, I'm going to re, I'm going to take a full year off and I'm going to revisit it. And here I am a year later and I have jumped back on board with all of the different social media platforms. So you will start seeing me post there. So I am on a lot of different platforms and that is Pinterest, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, Etsy's social media like platform, which is just integrated into their own little app, which has a long way to go, but I am there. And I am on YouTube on the community tab. So there are lots of different ways to follow me. And honestly, I'm just cross posting all of the same content on all of the different platforms. But I know as a consumer of social media, I can follow a, a creator of some sort on all of the different platforms and I may see different things on different platforms or I may not see them at all. Even though I'm cross posting all of the same content on all the different platforms, you may see it and you may not. So I do kind of encourage you to follow me on more than one platform if you're interested in just some of the extra things, the quick videos, the tips, the announcements, if I have a new product launch, things like that. But you don't have to, you're more than welcome to just hang out with me here. Cause like I said, I am on the community page here as well. You can always go, if you're on an actual desktop or a laptop, you can go to my YouTube and you'll see some tab options at the top. You can go to like videos or playlist and then there's a community tab and you can see what's available there, what I've posted, which is just usually pictures or announcements or things like that there. So that being said, there are lots of changes going on right now and we are kind of ever evolving and ever changing and just trying to see what feels good in our business as we grow and just kind of take it day by day. I would not be where I am in this business if it were not for you. Every single view, every single click, every single engagement with a thumbs up or even a thumbs down, all of that is helpful and it really does support my business. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. I'm so happy that you're here and I'm excited to see where we go from here as Rock City Cookies and I'm grateful that you're along for the ride. The graduation cookies are coming soon in just a few days. You will start seeing videos post for that and until then, thanks so much for watching, sweet friends. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.